Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I have a fun Happy Mail share of items that I received from Eve, who is Eve Ara 101 on Instagram and YouTube. She had a giveaway on her channel for a collab that she participated in recently and it was a Disney and Disney Princess themed collab. So I was lucky enough to win the items that she made. I think it was a three weeks long or so and she made at least three or four projects for that so first i'll get into the card that she gave me and it's really pretty very mini-esque nice layering that she did here i'm always admiring other people's cards because i'm really bad at making cards um she has all these layers and it's it's just really pretty and she was so sweet to just leave me a little note inside and she did, actually didn't write in the card so that i could basically re-gift this later on to someone else but it's just really pretty with these pink heart gems and die cut that says awesome and pink glitter it's it's very very mini mouse so thank you for that eve next i'll get into the dangle that she made and she said in her video when she presented this project that she bought this mini mouse at dollar tree and basically it's a figurine which she added a screw pin into so that she could turn it into a dangle and I just love all the little elements, lots of pink. She has a bow, she has glitter hearts. She's got these wire wrap beads. If you see the star one, she bought these, I think, play beads from Daiso and she did wire wrapping so that she could attach other beads to it and turn these into dangles. I also love this one with the flower bead cap on it as well as this bow, which definitely reminds me of Minnie Mouse. This might be from Creative Mojo Wholesale Studio, which is Oriel shop. I recall her having something like this there, but that this just really goes well with the Disney theme. And one other thing that she has here is this star ponytail holder, which I believe she said she also got from Daiso. So just really fun, big chunky dangle. And that was given in this packaging, which I take everything out of the packaging because my phone is really good at cr picking up crinkle noises. So yeah, here she just has a really nice iridescent tool bow with a little heart in the center or a heartbeat in the center and paper ruffle, which I think is like, <coughs> excuse me, a um, Minnie Mouse paper. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Okay, next is this really pretty Rapunzel themed container and I believe this is a KS craft die so it's basically a big kind of ornate heart and it has a box in the center but look how beautiful that is lots of pinks lots of layering look at this beautiful tulle bow with sequins in it and then she has this Rapunzel bottle cap as well as just lots of layering there's like a pink rosette some eyelash trim and really pretty dangles again she used that Daiso bead in this case it's a heart-shaped bead and wire wrapped around that I love these beads they're so pretty and inside she has this organza bag I believe this is a pom-pom keychain yes it is and it's so pink and fun it's very Minnie Mouse really nice mesh bow there and just a really fluffy pom-pom with hearts on both sides and hugs in this pink bead. Really pretty. Okay, my phone's about to die, so I'm trying to get through this real quick. So next is, I think, the, my favorite project that she made, which is this Mickey Mouse box. She made this out of wood, and it's got just really fun stitching along the panels here, this Mickey panel that has just basically the M for Mickey. And then I love this bow that she has on top. I think this is a KS craft die also. And she did it out of black glitter foam. Has this really cute Mickey bottle cap on it. A gem in the middle here. And again, lots of layering hollow doily and then a rosette and then some a rosette made of iridescent mesh tool. And then she also did a Velcro closure on this. And, oh, I forgot to mention this. It's a shaker on the, on the top here. So 
that's fun and you can peek through and you can see what she has inside. And in this case, it is the matching dangle, it's a matching Mickey dangle. And again, same thing, she took a Mickey figurine from Dollar Tree and just added a screw pin and turned it into a dangle. And she mentioned that she was going to use kind of more non-traditional Mickey colors and choose yellow instead of black or white or red. And I think that's, you know, really cool that she used something other than that. I just love all the different yellow pieces that she used. Some hearts, stars, and again, a star ponytail holder from Daiso. She has this little white tassel. Just love the assortment of beads she used. It's a fun, fun dangle. Love that as Disney inspiration. Oh wait, I forgot to mention that inside the box she had it lined and it's got Mickey paper and she included some shred and some fun vase filler in red and white. But I love how this box is hinged. So I'm gonna store the Mickey dangle back in here. Lastly, she also included a couple extra things. She has this fun pen with like a giant gem on top. Thank you for that, Eve. And also a Minnie Mouse keychain. Yeah, plush bag clip. Yeah, this thing is like a plushie. So yeah, that's my Happy Mail share of Eve's projects from her collab that she did for, I think the collab was for Pat, uh, Kathy's Favorite Things and Life with Patty. So yes, thanks again, Eve. I'm so happy to have won all this Disney items. It's great inspiration for my future Disney crafting. And thank you again for visiting my channel, everyone. Have a great day. Bye.